Welcome to episode 7 of Blogger Talk, which is all about video today, so let's get started. It's quite an interesting one, as it always is, and I'll tell you why, because there are so many alternatives. So, the blog that we're working on is the Mike Downs Creative, and as you can see, there's nothing on there, only the photo from last time. So, um, a while back, and it is a good while back, I made a post in the Blogger Forum to say, how can we make some video posts with tidy code and I will link to it later and you can see there is a bunch of code and questions didn't really get a good answer back doesn't matter what matters is that Google themselves with blogger have posted a couple of help screens and you'll notice that from this help screen there is a little clapperboard icon which allows you to post the video now um, I never use it I'll tell you why I'm gonna use it today but I'll tell you why I don't um, no secret I use YouTube um, now if you look down here, and this is this is pretty interesting stuff, is that where are my videos hosted? Well, they're hosted on Google Video, which is Google Plus Photos now. So, and also, more importantly, look at this. Are my videos indexed or searchable? No, they are kept private and will not be included in a Google Video search. Another reason why YouTube's a biggie for you. So, let's get started, and I'll show you as we do it. Oh, the, by the way, the video that we're working with today is something called Autumn Thistle that I took. Not that interesting, but the main thing is it's very short. Uh, actually, it's not bad, is it? It's 11 seconds long, and this is the one to look out for. So I've already put it somewhere. So let's just pause it there and also see, just as a, a double checker, that with this Mike Downs Media account, we've got um, Google Plus Photos. And you can see that this video is already uploaded there because I've put it there. And let's look at the main post. So all I've done here is put a brand new post out called how to post a video and I put some text on the left hand side there is there's nothing there apart from that look so some text so first thing let's put a video in and we're going to do that by using the clapperboard which is the upload a video now I can upload it I can do it from YouTube I can directly link from my YouTube videos but let's do one at a time so one of the reasons is that this thing's so small I say thing, I mean um, the video itself is only 2.4 megabytes. So I've chosen that from my hard drive and, oh goodness gracious me. No, I mean that's, um, well there's nothing wrong with it, is it? It's just saying that our video is uploading. Oh my goodness me. So I, d I don't mean to say it in that way, but all, all I'm saying is um, you get one of these like real old school, your video is being uploaded jobs. Wow. Let's have a look at the code on that. We learn something every day, and you can see that um, it's got blog video uploading. There's a little bit of code around the back end. So let's just see, and then, okay. No, I mean, that, that's why we're doing it. There's loads of different ways. So let's go to the, the, the second method, which is clapperboard again. And it says, I've, I've got to wait now because I'm uploading and processing your videos finished. Okay, fine, doesn't matter. Let's, while, while we're doing that, we'll go off. And do something else, uh, which is exactly what I was going to do anyway. Okay. And one of the ones is, and this is my favorite one, is to go to YouTube, go down where it says share, and you'll notice there is a blogger button there. Don't use it. You can do it if you want, but it tries to make a brand new post. And what you want to do is you have to go to embed and get the code. Now, I've written it down over here that the page width on the blog that I'm using, so I want to do page width, is 896. So I'm going to put 896. And you'll notice immediately, can you see, 896 has changed. And so I'm just going to copy that short code, which is an iframe. I'm going to go Control, C, and Copy. Now, you can notice there's a couple of other options down here. Show suggested videos at the end. A bit about privacy and using an old, old embed code. No idea why you why. Why you actually, no, I'm not going to use it. Um, of course I'm not. So I go back to the blogger post. And this time, now you notice between text 2 and text 3, I'm going to hit HTML. And then there's text 2 and text 3. And I'm just going to enter once, Control, V, and there it is, 896. Then I'm going to go back to Compose again. And while we're doing that, I'm just going to click the very first one that we did. And what we've got on the first one, I do, you know what, let's, let's just leave it. There is my video, which is already in from YouTube. And now let's try number between three and four. 
and we're going to, you know, I know you'd only do this once, but this is just a demonstration, isn't it? So we'd go and say, this time I want to go and look at my YouTube videos. And you can see that Autumn Thistle is already in here for Blogger Talk. So I'm saying, yes, I'd, I'd love to use that one. Isn't, wouldn't that be lovely? Now, it looks good, but there is some coding that, that comes over the back of it. And you can even look, it's even playing. It gives you a preview, and it, it's, it's pretty good. I mean, there's bottom line is there's about three or four or five different ways to do this. So that one's in. You'll notice that when it pops itself in, it's got this funny looking thing. So when I, when I click it, I can see how people get into major problems with this. So I'll, I'll just leave it. And then I'll go back to the HTML. And this is, this is the interesting bit. Look, look at this. So we go in, and we've got the first one. Let's just, just uh, get a highlighter here. This is the first one that we uploaded. Let's change the color to red. that do. This is the first one that we uploaded. This little one through here is the YouTube one. And the one, I'll just bring it down just to raise those. That's it. See, look at this, look at this code. Boom. See all that code, all that code has been bought in because we wanted to take it from YouTube. And there's loads of macromedia and shockwave type stuff in there. And I'm like, really? Do we need all of that? So, you know, one of these things of doing these videos, then perhaps we get one of the blogger engineers or something to come in and tell us what's going on. Because look at that, you've got a single line there and then a bunch of code down there. Let's see, let's go back again. As I say, I've said to you very much that, you know, I don't want to deal in code. I just want to, you know, get a story out and get a message out. So we've got the first one, which, which has got the little blogger in. It looks like something out of the 1980s, like Google was around then. We've got the massive one, which is paid with. We've got another one down there, which is like a sort of a four by three sort of thing. And then we've also got, um, is there another way to do it? Let's have a look. So I can go here and here again. I can say this time I want to go and have another look at the one. Okay, from my phone, from my webcam, you, you get the idea. Let's go and have a look at that as it is, completely raw as it is. And what I'm gonna do is publish it. And then finish the video in the next 20 seconds or so. So. I published it. I've already got a prompt to say, do I want to shove it out on um, Google Plus? Not at the moment, I don't. Thank you very much. I go back to the, the blog over here and I refresh it. While we're refreshing, we can just rock back and forth on our heels or something. You notice that you can see me in the, in the corner here now. I'm using zoom.us to record these, which because it's just like so cool. Now, this, this is what we've done in a very, very raw way. So what we've got is, let me just, just um, hide my picture there. So, so what we've got is at the top, it says how to post a video, which is the title. That's fine. Text one. Without any formatting, this video stays in the middle. Uh, when it plays, it looks very, you know, black um, borders here, top and bottom. Okay, fine. Um, notice that there's no access to, I can click through to YouTube, but I can't have any share buttons. Then I go down to the, the page with one, which I I'm still just inspired because it's so big. And this time I can play with the, the normal, you know, I'm already like, you know, awesome, fantastic, cool, look at that. Boom, there's a, you know, there, I like it, you know, in other words. By hovering around, we're already getting the, the, the like buttons here, the thumbs up. We've got uh, a click in for the new player, and I can already go to Facebook, Twitter, Google Plus, and a bunch of others. I've got the short code there, and that's the, the regular style that we're used to seeing. And then I've also got the little information button that, that tells us that we've got a, you know, just tells us stuff, doesn't it? And then going down at the bottom, we've also got, I can't remember what this one was now, um, but also another little squatty player. We've got an information thing going on here which is like the other one when we play it we've also got um it's one of the old style ones remember there was some kind of shockwave macromedia flash thing all i want to know is to say that if we had to choose again then the huge big one there which okay fine i did page width looks okay um what i suggest i should do is just get off this uh video and do something else because at the end of the day there is a bunch of i'm just going to reset that and I'll tell you why is because as a final caveat to this we've got on the left hand side it says post a picture post videos but there is a help page to do with come on load um, to embed a let's just bring it in a bit for you let's do it 
posting video from YouTube, you can embed or you can embed manually, and it does tell you. But the interesting part about this, and perhaps I'll do a second session on this just to finish, and that is that we've got posting audio because, as we know, Blogger, Google, the, the rest of the bunch didn't get involved with audio because they told you to go to a third party and that third party at the moment, not owned by them, but um, SoundCloud, which I might do a session on that because I, I love SoundCloud, don't use it much, but uh, I do like the players and you've probably seen them swanning about um, Google Plus. So that was the blog post, messy as anything, but the point of it is you can do it in a bunch of different ways. Okay, link it up, thanks very much, and I'll be back with um, the next episode, probably in the next half hour or so.